everybody, welcome back to our Youth Services, Youth Services of channel or IGTV. I hope you have a great day at school. So today we're going to be coming back with a fun project. We're going to make a DNA candy model. You probably, for the younger kids, you probably never heard about DNA before. It's a fourth grade science, but basically DNA is what make uh, cells in our body, okay? To understand uh, what the concept is, I have this model to project it to you. So you need a spice drop, but if you don't like spice, a spice drop, that's fine. You can have a giant jelly like so. So whatever you prefer. And then Twizzler, okay? So this is a fun way to do, but if you don't like Twizzler, you can do it with beef jerky, so however you like. And then of course, um, toothpicks, okay? So what we're going to do is, we're going to separate the color, which, whichever color you like. So I would just pick a random color here. Um, put purple and this one is kind of like a um, clear one white one so put it aside like so the next color is um, yellow like this and then red so you might wonder like why is it different color so it have to be different shade because DNA has a four type is a G C G so it's adenine thymine cytosine and guanine so something like that Okay, and then we're going to use the Twizzler as our uh, sugar phosphate backbone, okay? And then what you're going to do is, it's basically an edible craft too, so I know all of you like edible stuff, especially candy, who doesn't like candy? Okay, put it like so, and put the other attachment, other Twizzler on the other side. Okay, like so. And then do the same thing with the second one. Okay, uh, let's do one more. Have a purple one here. And then take the orange one. Like so it doesn't need to be perfect as long as you get the concept, I'll be happy with it. And then you put it on the next twister. So you actually you make a ladder like that. Okay? And then you can make how many however you want. I would suggest like make four or five, but you don't have to really. And then you twist it, like see these. So this is what we call DNA double helix. So every DNA has a two sets of each cell's pair. So like that. Okay, for younger kids, you probably learn it in fourth grade uh, biology or science. So this is our project for today. I hope you have fun. Uh, if you have any uh, question or comment, please let, let us know in our IG or our YouTube, and then I'll get into it. And then don't forget to uh, watch our Make It Monday and our story time. Until next time, I'll see you soon.